can you hear us? Yes. Can you hear me? Mm, probably we can hear you now there. Okay. He's good. All right. Well, let's... Okay. Are we ready to go for the... Yeah, we can. Race then? Let's we'll, just do that. We'll now. just start. Okay. So I'm going to... Uh, well, maybe after we do the update, we will... Wait until they have a red light. So you guys are at the Greyhound station right now? Yeah, we've got picture proof on Twitter, and uh, there's the Greyhound sign out the window. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. The sun, we, there it is, yeah. Can we switch over to their... Uh... Yeah, sorry. Uh, yes, everyone did message the wrong Morgan. Just one second. Except for Duck A. Okay, here, here we, go. we go. So this is live from Tucson. Update from Welcome the to Tucson. It is uh, it is gorgeous. And what is it, you think, Jeff? Like 75 degrees here right now? At least 105 degrees out. It's probably about 105 <laughs> degrees out here. Oh, All right. Wow. It is cold and rainy where we are. So, yes. <laughs> so that works so out well. We are, we are ready to roll, gentlemen. And uh, the race is on. All right. All here right. we go. Morgan. Let's do it. Begin. Wait. Go. Go. Yeah. Yeah. Go, game, go. go. Let's do it, Jeff. Oh, it's taking forever to start. <laughs> My acceleration is so bad. How do we go? We still have to start the engine. Uh, uh, not, it's nope. not even turning over. <laughs> Shit, there's no power. <laughs> go, go. Uh, I'm not even <laughs> going yet. Okay, right. here yeah. we go. There We're we go. still with you. We're winning. <laughs> We're winning. No way, dude. <laughs> <laughs> We're winning. Oh, All right. I see that you're playing this live. <laughs> this is live. Use the internet. The best things in life are free. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like traveling to Vegas with my buddy Reed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. The best desert bus. That is a, that is a pretty sweet t-shirt you're wearing there, by the way. Yeah. All right, Jeff. Jeff, we need to give Desert Bus a chance to respond. All right. <laughs> uh, my response is, next year I'm coming with you guys, because that looks way more awesome. <laughs> <laughs> you traitor! <laughs> so, uh, so guys, what's the plan for checking in? Are you, do you want to check in every half hour or so, or what do you think? That sounds good. Um, what, uh, we had a couple of questions first. Which uh, road are you taking? Uh, so we're taking I-10, and then, Jeff, what are, what are we taking after that? Let's see our directions. Read one moment while I get this camera out of my lap. <laughs> uh, all right. So uh, Google Maps has been our uh, has been our buddy. We printed out some directions last night. Jeff, show them the directions. Show them the title. This is the best road trip map ever because we'll beat Desert Bus. <laughs> <laughs> oh ho ho! Well, we'll just see about that. <laughs> all right, we're going to be taking. Uh, 10 west, and then we're gonna travel for about 109 miles. Oh, that, that's actually true. Can you guys set your uh, set your odometer? Re yeah, reset your odometer reset so your, we can. Yeah, reset the trip so we can see oh, how long. Yeah, that's, that's right. Yeah, let me see if I get that. So give or take about 0.5 miles from the Greyhound station. Okay. Now, we're not saying that if you live somewhere between uh, Tucson and Las Vegas, you should try to cause a traffic jam. <laughs> we, but, in, in no way can we, author, can we uh, encourage that. But if one happens, that would be interesting. <laughs> Just let it be known that we don't have health insurance. Yeah. Okay. If you guys are going to get us in a wreck, you need to bring uh -huh. some sand or something to make it worth our while. Maybe a little bit of lemonade in the thermos. You can come up here and get health insurance. <laughs> All right, so... Guys, can you get yeah. a can you get a shot out the front window so we have like yeah ideally ideally with the with, with the steering wheel with the steering wheel in the bottom left hand corner of the shot. What? Look, I'm winning already. Oh, oh nice. there it is. Nice. Nice. Uh, that they looks... don't even have a spinning tree. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you guys, yeah, that yeah, would you guys, awesome. Where's your air freshener? Yeah, okay, first gas. gas yeah, first gas station. Grab a air the tree freshener. The truth is, we went to Walmart last night against all of our morals and uh we, we we almost uh picked up a um well we, we picked up this thing which is a uh power inverter or whatever and i remember looking at the uh what are they that the air fresheners and i was thinking reed we should get one of those but i didn't say anything so now i feel really bad we are so close and yet so far <laughs> but yeah anyway i'm pretty sure that we'll wind up beating you guys at a rate of i think we're going to get there in about five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, good. 
People in the chat are also saying that you need to get a bug splat to put on the windshield partway through. Yeah, yeah five hours. even if you get there first, you've lost the moral victory because <laughs> you haven't got a bug splat or a spinning tree. <laughs> well, we, we spent, what is it, all weekend trying to clean these windows, Green. Yeah. We the wrong them. direction. So you're moving away from where you need to be. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Jeff, we need, I think maybe when we stop at a gas station, uh, uh, Maybe we'll take the opportunity to throw some fake bug guts on the window or something. If you can scrape the video. bugs off of the windows of the other vehicles at the gas station and apply it to your own, like that it. would be helpful. <laughs> nice. I wish we could find a truck to help us out. We could always just pick up some Taco Bell beef. And throw <laughs> that also. It's already green, so you're set. <laughs> So the, the plan is for you guys to go to the Greyhound station in Las Vegas, right? Yes, yep. that's where our map goes straight to. All right. We go to, let's see if I can get a picture of this. It's very difficult. Here's the macro lens. There we are. Yeah. So that's the Greyhound station. And we're, um, we're excited. We're hoping that there's going to be some light outside of there so we can actually get a decent picture for you guys. Yeah, I think, I think we've decided we're going to limit ourselves to 10 miles uh, per hour below the speed limit. Uh, to make it a competitive race. Wow. Let's well, really? just make it 10 miles an hour. What? So, well, what? Yeah. Let's just make it 10 miles an hour. Is it just 10 miles an hour period? I think we can probably handle it. Oh, they're yeah. going to love you. <laughs> <laughs> what What can you drive? Like, what? what's the highway speed limit where you are? Well, that's the nice thing about Arizona. This is uh, the land of guns and eagles, and we are free to do whatever the heck we want. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we can drive as fast as, like, 75 miles an hour, I think, is the speed limit in most places. Wow. Oh, nice. Yeah. I, I don't know. On 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 our equivalent of of an interstate, it's 110 kilometers an hour is the absolute maximum speed in Canada, and I believe that There's, is about 70 miles an hour. Yeah, I think yeah. so. There's yeah. only okay. one very short stretch of road on the entire island that is actually 110. However, that is it's true. Speed limit, but that is not how fast you actually <laughs> No, I've done 180 on that. <laughs> oh crap! 180 would probably be the equivalent about of 110 or 115 One, miles an hour. 115 miles an hour. Yeah, th th there's no speed limit. Morgan would lose his license if he actually did that. But, uh, if he got caught. <laughs> if I got caught. If he got dead. caught. Except right, I'm going right, too fast to get caught. <laughs> I told my roommate last night about this whole desert bus trip, and she said, "Wait, wait, wait! What, what is it?" And I was like, "Well." It's this game that Penn and Teller, I guess, conceived, and it's kind of a joke on the gamer, as far as I can tell, because it's very <laughs> difficult to play. Uh, and she said, "Well, I don't get it." And I said, "Well, you should just watch the, you should just watch the, uh, the broadcast." And so she sent out a tweet to all of her friends, and um, the tweet just said, "I don't understand this madness." <laughs> was, That's a pretty accurate. Accurate summary of what's going on here, I think. Girls are very prone to the brain worms. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> Actually, hey, look. The <laughs> yeah, wow. Union High School, district number 20. What if they don't run the internet right now? <laughs> he has no clue. <laughs> so, uh, this might be a good time to mention those very stylish t shirts that you guys are wearing. Because those, oh, yes. those are quite Our fetching. Bus. Oh, wow. They're That's very not, fetching. We are, uh, we are we're both wearing the we wonderful actually, desert butts. We actually shipped out about, um, I don't know, we shipped out a couple dozen of them last night, and I think uh, uh, Steve and Ryan are getting the mail today, shipping out the remainder uh, of the black shirts that we can ship, and then the uh, the black reorders and the cranberry shirts will be coming in sometime in mid-December, so we'll ship the rest out then. Awesome. awesome. And so. actually, any order for Desert Bus shirts that are made in the next 15 minutes will be sent straight from, from this van. Yes. <laughs> hey, look, there's action on the side of the road. Oh, crap. Oh, dear God, what's happening? <laughs> so, so, guys, am I correct that in Desert Bus, the only other vehicle you see on the road is just a, uh, a tow truck? Is that right? You yeah, never actually you're... see the tow truck. The you tow truck comes it. up behind you. It's an implied tow truck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The is only the only visual indication of the tow truck is you see a red light flashing and then you get picked up. So there is no so, other cars. So Desert Bus is kind of like Bioshock in that you're all alone and you have Indeed. no human contact. Indeed, it does, it does uh, get some of the same feeling as Bioshock. <laughs>
many would say it's a precursor <laughs> yeah. to Bioshock. It, the, the, it's the true. Bioshock is the is at least the, one person has said that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, uh, I guess we will, uh, maybe, uh, check in with you guys in, uh, half an hour or so. See how you're doing. Sorry, we didn't catch that. Okay. Yeah, we will, we will meet you guys in, uh, Casa Grande. Hopefully we'll be there by the time. All right. Uh, we'll meet you guys near Picacho Peak, which is where we should end up when you, uh, when you call again. Sounds good. We'll talk to you at right. about nine thirty then. We'll just right, see folks, how we'll how soon. far how far yeah, ahead of uh, how, how far ahead of you guys we are by then. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure it'll be very far. Uh, Larska says, "Oh, I Actually, know exactly know where the fan game is." Yeah. Oh. I've driven that highway. Uh, as previously mentioned, we cannot endorse any kind of. Uh, we would we would never endorse you starting a traffic jam <laughs> or any kind of accident, but. These things sometimes happen, and sometimes they happen with your involvement. <laughs> like, say, it's, say you drive truck, you and you have an 18-wheeler, and you want to, you know, park it across the inter interstate. That's, I hope this guy sure. here is not listening to you guys. Th this guy isn't with you, is he? <laughs> <laughs> no, but he, can you give him our phone number? <laughs> Does he have one of those, don't, don't like my driving, here's yeah. the number? <laughs> <laughs> to uh to be fair actually if there is anybody like it would be pretty incredible if somebody was like standing by the side of the road with a sign saying like uh, uh, desert uh, bus we'll, go we'll stop, we'll stop taking a picture with them. yeah if, if somebody is out, out there on the highway with a sign we will stop and get a picture we will sacrifice the minutes we're willing to do it awesome. all right okay, you so it here. anybody who lives anywhere between uh tucson and las vegas it's highway 10 you guys are on they're good highway 10 no. west but then they're going north after that right yeah, we're going to be going, uh, I would tell yeah, we're going, like, straight through a desert. So if you really want to be crazy, you can, like, get out to the desert and All everything, right. and you can bring some water. And, so I, guess, me a message. and I guess people could uh, tweet you if they're uh, going to be hey, Bill's somewhere. Mom. So, uh, hey. so are you heading up Highway 17 once you, uh, once you get to Phoenix? Is that the idea? Uh, no, we're actually going to be going through, uh, what is that? Wickenburg? Yes. Yeah, so. oh. And where you will see a desert bus sign, and you must stop because you said you would. Oh, there, crap. There's going to be a desert bus guy there? One is already oh. being set up as we speak. So watch <laughs> out for it. My goodness. This All is right. going to be fabulous. I am super pumped. All right. Well, I, I, I can't wait to see what will happen, Reed. I'm All right. sure it will be good times. It's going to be beautiful. Oh, people want me to say that's actually Highway I-9. Or I-10. Sorry. Highway I-10, not Highway 10. Different highways. Okay. Yeah. Interstate 10. All right. Awesome. Talk to you in half an hour, we'll Reed. Talk to you guys in a bit. Talk to you guys soon. You guys got somebody to set up a desert bus sign? Apparently, somebody said they're going to do that. Where, are they driving a bus? or? They're driving a bus from Tucson. Yeah, I do that, they're but actually, I just didn't know what vehicle they're, they're, they're in. They're in a, a, a really a big, big van. van. Yeah, yeah, big van. Loaded big with van. their t-shirts. Yeah. To which they will be shipping them from the van, apparently. <laughs> I, I would never advise, thank you so much, Sorry. that, um, I mean, do you know, on old vans, sometimes things go wrong with them. <laughs> Like, uh, let out. yeah, no, like, uh, the brake lines just get our shot. They frequently cut themselves. I, I love how Bill's mom is handing you one thing at a time. It's like every single thing is just a single thing. And you can't have Thank you, Bill's time. mom. You know, I love four packets of sugar in my coffee. So, okay, so if you live between Tucson and Phoenix on the I-10, get out there with your signs. This is our 